Hello students, welcome to Charu's classes. Today we are going to start exercise 2.3 fractions and decimals class 7. Question number 1. Find 1 by 4 of a is 1 by 4. So we have to find 1 by 4 of 1 by 4. Maths mein of ka use multiplication ke liye hota hai. So we can write it as 1 by 4 multiplied by 1 by 4. Dono numerators multiply karenge, we are getting 1 and dono denominators 4 into 4 is coming 16. So here the answer is 1 by 16. B, 1 by 4 of 3 by 5. That is 1 by 4 multiplied by 3 by 5. Numerators multiply karenge, so we are getting 3 and 4 into 5, we are getting 20. So the answer for this B part is 3 by 20. C, 1 by 4 of 4 by 3. That is 1 by 4 multiplied by 4 by 3. So we are getting 4 by 12. Ye dono 4 ke table mein aate hai, to we can cancel it. 4 ones are and 4 threes are. That gives us the answer as 1 by 3. Second part, 1 by 7 of a is 2 by 9. So that can be written as 1 by 7 into 2 by 9, which is 2 by 63. B part, 1 by 7 of 6 by 5. That means 1 by 7 multiplied by 6 by 5. That is 6 by 35. C part 1 by 7 of 3 by 10. This is 1 by 7 multiplied by 3 by 10. And the answer here is 3 by 70. Second question. Multiply and reduce to lowest form if possible. So the first question is 2 by 3 multiplied by 2, 2 by 3. So, sabse pehle hum 2, 2 by 3 ko solve kar lete hain. 2 and 3 ko multiply karenge. That is 6 plus ye numerator 2. That will give us 8 by 3. So, this is coming as 2 into 8. That is 16. Divided by 3 into 3. That is 9. They have asked us to convert it into a mixed fraction. Or to reduce to a lowest form if it is possible. Jab bhi numerator bada hota hai, denominator se, this is an improper fraction aur usse hum mix fraction ke form mein likhte hai. So, 9 ones are 9 and the remainder is 7. Mixed form mein likhne ke liye hum divide karte hai aur jo quotient hota hai, that comes as a whole number, jo remainder hai, wo numerator ki jaga aata hai aur jo divisor ya denominator hai, wo same rehta hai. So, this can be written as 1 7 by 9. Second part, 2 by 7 into 7 by 9. Yahaan pe hum chahe to 7 and 7 ko directly cancel kar sakte hai. Numerator and denominator ye division mein hote hai. To inko agar ye same table mein aate hai, we can always divide and cancel. So here the answer is 2 by 9. This is a proper fraction. So, we can't simplify this and 9 in same table. Mein bhi nahi aate so, here the answer is 2 by 9. Third one, 3 by 8 multiplied by 6 by 4. So, here uh, 6 and 4, dono 2k table, mein aate hai. we can cancel it. 2 3s are and 2 2s are. Now 3 into 3 is 9 and denominator is 8 into 2 that is 16. So here the answer is 9 by 16. Isse zada hum isse simplify nahi kar sakte. Fourth part 9 by 5 multiplied by 3 by 5. Yahan kuch cancel nahi ho raha so we are simply going to multiply. 9 3s are 27 and 5 into 5 is 25. 
Now this is an improper fraction. Numerator bada hai, denominator chota hai. So we are going to divide. 25 ones are 25 and remainder is 2. So we can write mixed fraction mein hum likh sakte hai, 1, 2 by 25. Part 5, 1 by 3 multiplied by 15 by 8. So 1 into 15 is 15 and 3 into 8 is 24. Now in this case, 15 and 24, they can be simplified. They both are there in the table of 3. So this come 3 se cancel karenge, 3 5s are and 3 8s are. So the answer here is 5 by 8. Sixth. 11 by 2 multiplied by 3 by 10. 11 3s are 33 and 2 10s are 20. 33 by 20 is an improper fraction. Numerator bada hai denominator se. To isko hum solve karenge or mixed fraction ke form mein likhenge. 20 1s are 20 and the denominator, uh, the remainder is 13. To yahaan pe answer aayega 1 13 by 20. Part 7, 4 by 5 multiplied by 12 by 7. So 4 into 12, that is 48. And 5 into 7, that is 35. Again, 48 by 35 is an improper fraction. So we have to convert mixed fraction. Mein convert karna padega, divide karke. 35 ones are 35. And we are getting 13 as the remainder. So, 48 by 35 can be written as 1, 13 by 35. Question number 3. Multiply the following fractions. First part, 2 by 5 multiplied by 5, 1 by 4. So, sabse pehle, 5, 1 by 4 ko hum solve kar lete hai. 5 into 4, 20 plus 1. So, this is 21 by 4. Now, we just have to multiply. In fact, 2 and 4 can be cancelled. 2 ones are and 2 twos are. So the answer coming here is 1 into 21, 21 and 5 twos are 10. Now this is an improper fraction. So we divide here. 10 twos are 20 and 1 is the remainder. So 21 by 10 ko, we can write it as 2 1 by 10. Part 2, 6, 2 by 5 multiplied by 7 by 9. Let's solve 6, 2 by 5 first. So 6 into 5, 30 plus 2. This is 32 by 5 multiplied by 7 by 9. So if we solve it, 32 into 7 karenge, you will get 224 and 5 into 9 is 45. So this is an improper fraction. Hum 224 ko 45 se divide kar lete hain. So 45 fours are 180 because fives are is going to be more than this. And the remainder coming is 44. So this can be written as yahan pe jo quotient hai that will come as a whole number. So 4, 44 by 45. This is your answer. Part 3, 3 by 2 multiplied by 5, 1 by 3. We can write it as 5 into 3, 15 plus 1, 16 by 3. Now this 3 and 3 can cancel. So 16 by 2 which is 8. So here the answer is 8. Fourth part, 5 by 6 multiplied by 2, 3 by 7. So this is 5 by 6 into 2 7s are 14, 14 plus 3, 17 by 7. Let's multiply, 17 into 5 is 85 and 6 7s are is 42. So improper fraction, hai. Isse hume mixed fraction. Mein banana hai. 42 2s are 84. And 1 is the remainder. 
So this can be written as 2 1 by 42. Part 5 3 2 by 5 multiplied by 4 by 7. So 3 2 by 5 ko we can write 3 5 is 15 plus 2 17 by 5 multiplied by 4 by 7. Yaha kuch bhi numerator denominator cancel nahi ho raha hai. So we'll just simply multiply and write 17 4 is 68 and 5 7 is 35. So let's divide it now. 35 1 is 35 and the remainder is coming as 33. So this can be written as 133 by 35. Part 6, 2, 3 by 5 into 3. 2, 3 by 5, 2 into 5, 10 plus 3. So, here will 13 by 5 multiplied by 3. 13, 3 is 39 by 5. Is a mixed fraction may convert kar lenge. 5, 7 is 35. And 4 is the remainder. So, 39 by 5 can be written as 7, 4 by 5. Question number 4, which is greater, 2 by 7 of 3 by 4 or 3 by 5 of 5 by 8? So, we have to compare karna hai. Isse, isse. So, let's first check 2 by 7 of 3 by 4. So, as you know, of means multiply. So, 2 by 7 into 3 by 4. This 2 and 4 can cancel. 2 1s are and 2 2s are. This is coming as 3 by 14. So, this is our first one. Now, let's find out 3 by 5 of 5 by 8. That is 3 by 5 multiplied by 5 by 8. This 5 and 5 will cancel. This is giving us 3 by 8. We have to compare both of them. As we know, we can compare only if they are. It's, uh, we compare it by making them into like fractions. यानी कि इन दोनों के डिनोमिनेटर्स हम सेम करके इन्हें कंपेयर करते हैं। सो डिनोमिनेटर्स यहाँ पे 14 एंड 8 है। तो वी आर गोइंग टू टेक एलसीएम ऑफ डिनोमिनेटर्स। दैट इस 14 एंड 8। लेट्स डू दैट। टू सेवेंजा एंड फोरजा। सो दिस एलसीएम इस कमिंग 2 into 2, 4, 4 into 2, 8, 8 into 7, 56. अब हमें इन दोनों numbers को denominator 56 में convert कर देना है. So 3 by 14 if we want to compare it to the other number and we have to convert it into denominator 56, we know that 14 4s are 56 होता है. तो ऊपर नीचे हम same number से multiply कर लेंगे. That will give us 12 by 56. And second number is 3 by 8. 8 ko 7 se multiply karo. To 56 aata hai. 3 ko bhi hum 7 se karenge. That is giving us 21 by 56. So as you can see 21 by 56 is bigger than 12 by 56. Or in other ways we can say 3 by 8 is greater than 3 by 14. Ya jo second number tha. 3 by 5 or 5 by 8. That is actually the greater one. Second part, half of 6 by 7 or 2 by 3 of 3 by 7. So, half of 6 by 7 pehle kar lete hai. That is half multiplied by 6 by 7. 2 and 6 can be cancelled. 2 3s are 6. That is giving us 3 by 7 as the answer here. Next is 2 by 3 of 3 by 7. That is 2 by 3 multiplied by 3 by 7. 3 and 3 will cancel and we are getting 2 by 7. We have to compare 1 and 2. Now in this case they are already like fractions. Dono ke denominator is same hai. So we can easily see that 3 by 7 is greater than 2 by 7. Or in other words we can say half of 6 by 7 is greater than 2 by 3 of 3 by 7. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.